Alright, so what is good everybody? We are back with another Marvel Snap video. Uh, we're going to be playing a move deck here. Let me just show you guys the deck real quick. This, this, I've had this move deck for a long time. It's just kind of been getting... Add, it's more things been added onto it. I remember... I think Doctor Strange and Vulture. I, I mean, I had this deck a long time ago. I think it used to have like most. Just think of the most earliest move cards you could think of, like Nightcrawler, Craven, Iron Fist, or like some of the early ones. I think you get Human Torch later. Most of is kind of early on, but you can definitely get Clothed and Vulture later. And um, I think Doctor Strange is kind of he's a he was a late pool one for me. I want to say, and uh, I think Heimdall is like one of those early. He's an early early um. He's definitely an early, like, pool one card, I want to say, even so. So, definitely. Let's just jump into it. Uh, this deck is really fun. You can beat a lot of, even, like, later decks uh, with this. I beat Patriot decks. If you want you guys need to watch part one, I, you can put, you can beat a lot of decks, really. I feel like, okay, and, and this is the best thing you can get from this deck is just being able to draw more cards is really the best potential Move here. So we really want to three. How many we got? One, two, three. Okay, we can afford not to draw a card, right? Yeah, we have seven, right? We can actually afford not to draw one. So he, okay, that's interesting. This gives us a chance to scout out one more card. Nightcrawler does not help us at all. So. It does not help. What's the, how many cards we got left? So there's a multiple man who's left. Or do we just put Force down? I think Force just comes out here. We're trying to play this slow, and I really need to put some more cards on the far. Let me just see what's on that right side first. Okay, that's fine. Oh good, thank you. I forgot about Vulture too. So we had there was three cards. There was there was a three out of five chance that we pulled the cards that would move for us, and of course we get him late. I let know if we're gonna pull the same play here. So cough is so cough is so like a, such a negative here for us. Because he helps them out just as much. And if we're not on the same move level right now, it wouldn't just hurt us more than help us. And we can really only play Doctor Strange's turn anyway, it seems like. Uh, yeah, what sucks here, though, is Craven doesn't move. He moves only one card on him. The fact that we're going to have almost identical um, right sides here. But my cards look a little bit just better, if you know what I mean. And, and, and it's not bragging. It's one of, the, like I said, the biggest, one of the bigger reasons I'm using this, this deck is because of just the variance I have, I feel like. So. Wait, why did he move both of them? Okay. Oh, that's, that's good for us because that gives him a double boost. Morales in Dagger. What do you do? What in the world? <laughs> Dagger's kind of broken. <laughs> Are we going to talk about that? Yeah, Honda has to come out here. Um, So, does he just come out? Does he win? Does he win? Um, hmm. Options here. Instead of Heimdall, we could pit Cloth in. We actually could. Well, that's interesting. Torch goes up by two for him now. 
We could do this. And that gives us 10 instead of just the 8 from Heimdall. Well, then, well, no, that's the same because we get Nightcrawler, so. What is he, what happens if he piss Heimdall down? I think he beats us out, though. Should I block his, should I block Vulture coming out? Hmm. Let's see what happens here. Oh, we just pissed another card off. This gotta be Heimdall, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. So he actually made the mistake of not pitting, because that, yeah, human person, five, yeah, one. Ooh, I forgot about that. Oh, so incredible playing on move deck. Oh yeah, here I meant to show you guys this human torch. So look at you can you can see his reflection on the glass. When have you ever ever just like I've seen some like I I immediately saw this and just bought them without hesitation. And I've been saving up my coins a lot that like this these are the cards I wait to find and see. But like just and him I'm like probably like human torch is definitely my favorite Fantastic Four. Um, he's up there for like he's definitely probably my top five Marvel characters. Um, yeah, just it's it's probably yeah him, Black Panther, Captain America, uh, Iron Man. Honestly, Iron Man is an underrated character in my top in my opinion. He's pretty popular, I think, in general. But and who would be else in that five? Really, it could. I would have to really look at the list. This this not in no order by the way. It might even be a, an X Men. I want I even might even say Scott really Scott Summers, but so it might even be it might be Cyclops in there. I do like Wolverine too though. Is there any other X Men I really like? I do like Quicksilver, but mainly just the one in first class series. Okay. Is that a free one? Is that a free? Give me. Okay, there it is. It's not even gonna give me a cube. Yeah. So we're not we're not climbing too fast right now with this deck. I'll tell you that. But it's definitely because we're not. We haven't even been snapping. It's it's, it's it, almost every game is like, is this gonna work? It is. It's just it's just a, that type of deal. So <laughs> options here. I think we could still just. Hmm. No point in getting Iron Fist now so early. Yeah, we because we can actually. Uh, never mind. We should have put him down. The Heimdall would have. That would have just. I hate. I hate that when it comes to like the six, the six twelve, six eights because you just then you just get a six six. So it of. Oh, that might be a potential. Oh, good. We get a redraw after this. That is crazy. Well, let me just put some of these, like, useless cards down, then. Yeah, because we need... We don't... We don't... It's no purpose of getting cloth right now. And, of course, you do that. And how is that even possible? Aren't you a five cost? That was turn. What? Oh, it is a three five because of the switch. Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. I was say, is is there a re like? I mean. Hmm. I think okay. We need really need like human torture. Nope. Okay. I was gonna say we really like for us to really make make a play here. We need to like. Yeah. Okay. Cause we was filling up his hand. Let me see how many cards he has. He has seven. 
Hmm. That leech coming out was tough. Yeah, I think we leave here because yeah, I, I, we needed like right there. We we had a good human torch set up. If forge torch, um, yeah, fine. Cause that went on there. Yeah, we would, we was pretty nice. We would have been pretty nice there. Forge human torch. Then with cloth, that would have been eight in one location. And then we could have put just put Heimdall down. We we would have to thought about that, but it had a time. But I think. Just because he wasn't, I don't think he was going to play on that left side. He, I don't think he wanted to give me his cards. Definitely didn't want to give me his cards. But anyways, yeah, that that that's sometimes. I mean, that that's, that's the thing about Marvel Snap, man. Is some games completely out of your control, uh, especially if it's RNG related. Like like it just locations do matter a lot on this game. I'll tell you that matters a lot. Is there any card that I don't mind getting revealed until the end? Nope. This makes things tricky because we have to kind of. There's a Heimdall. Okay, so. Another move deck? Are you serious? How many move decks are we going to play today? Let's just, just let's not waste any real power here. Let's go ahead and get get what we need going. Looks like a vulture play is coming in the works. Man, we just need if multiple. Yeah, we need multiple man right now because he would he would actually he would carry that five with him. Oh, okay, that's interesting. Cause oh, there it is. I spoke him up. But we really need you to. We need vulture right now. So. We need uh, it's a lot of things. We need next turn. We need a cloth. Oh, there's the cloth for us. So we actually move Titania because that can be difficult. Ah. Uh. That's fine. Play something there. Fill up that spot for me, sir. I think you've been craving there, right? Because if I... Or should I put Multiman down for... It's too late. I should have played Multiman first, then move Titania. Or does that even matter? Well, it, it, it's actually... It'd be a good thing if I can... So, yeah, she moves, She flips back over there. Which is fine, I think. Well, I mean, this man just this man he comes out with the last possible second. <sighs> Issues here is Is there an issue here? Well, not really. Cuz multiple we still keep multiple man. I think Heimdall here works. Because we do keep multi is once again, uh, this this deck requires a big brain. You have to remember all the elements. Like the, literally, I feel like every turn should take you probably like half half of your time to think. Because, and like, I mean, sometimes it's straightforward and easy. But I think here, most we do got to remember if he plays, if he also plays Heimdall, who goes first here? We go first. Here. I think I have to move Titania. So I mean, obviously, this is obviously a Heimdall. We still we still keep most of man though. That's the good thing. So we we win that spot for sure. I think if a Heimdall comes out, if Heimdall doesn't come out, 
Okay, thanks, Arrow. Y'all get up out of here. Whoa. How much did she get? Oh, we... Ah, Vulture goes up. We lose. Or do we? Let me do... I can't... Can't do the math quick enough. I think we lose. How did the time... Uh, how did she not move? It's interesting enough. Oh, because Heimdall was blocking one. Did he? And once he, I sometimes wonder with these, like, do did they realize that at the time? If only we could have moved. Instead of Titania, we should have moved Mo. We should have moved Mojo. That's actually we should have moved Mojo for sure in that spot. We knew it was gonna be four over there, in that corner. I need, I guess Dagger, I guess I need Dagger now. Dagger seems really OP. I, I don't even, I didn't even know about Dagger. That's a pool, this is why this is a pool of three deck, because I think Dagger is what a pool of four card or so. Definitely not pool of three, I'm pretty sure. Could be wrong, I could be, I could, could be talking about my neck, out of my neck right now. <laughs> wow. So, we can almost even snap here because of that, because, okay, 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 okay. We're guaranteed time to play. Oh, boy. And there's... Ah, uh, we don't need two of them. But we can play both, though. That's, oh, we can play both. Let's remember that. Let's remember that. Okay, and, okay, 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 okay. Because... This is fine too, cause then we, yeah, this is fine. We still, cause I don't, I don't want to piss him on that right side, and it's like a neg, it's, it's a negative or whatever, whatever. So oof, he is, he's gonna go off on me. Okay, good, perfect. Oops. Literally, just why I, I had that thought, I said, you know, it wouldn't even be worth it. Darn, though here. Well, if we make okay, actually, this is better. Let's do this first, and then. Yeah, the double Heimdall works too. Yeah, this works, this works, this works. I think we can, actually, let's just go ahead and snap because I don't want to, ah, uh, I think, I think this just works. I think this really works here. Okay, so let me guys see what my plan here is. So Vulture down, next turn we're going to put Doctor Strange down, okay. He has no way to do with his uh cop. Oh yeah, we you you messed up because <laughs> we weren't even gonna play any cards on that side. He could have he could throw our plan for a loop anywhere else with that Cosmo. So here's the play here. We get the both of these moves. We still keep that multiple man. Multiple man's gonna we're gonna have a plus a seven multiple man. Then we're gonna split him twice with uh. So we're gonna put two sevens in that corner with uh Heimdall. And yeah, I think because I think what I also what I also want to do. Who else do we do we want? I think we want the other Heimdall in that corner too. Right, because then who who goes in that corner? Heimdall. We can also move out Nightcrawler at any point too. And he just snapped on us. Oh, what happens here though is, oh, yeah, okay, now everyone moves. Never mind. Ah, uh, we don't get that second. I didn't even think about that. We don't get that second. Um. Okay, that's fine. Did he foresee a Heimdall play there? Maybe he did, maybe he didn't. Do we gain more by putting these individual cards? Four, four, three, wait. Let me do the math there. Yeah, that's nine. 
Is a five plus four, so it's a potential one more. Oh, that's the card that he was given. So, who? So, what's your actual eight? Because this is, I can tell this is in his actual home. Though. What's your actual eight? I mean, six cost card. I wonder, does he does he retreat here? So we already had that three there. That's good. What potential play could he have made? No, I guess he ran out of time or lost connection or something. I don't even understand the thought process in that. But imagine he went middle with <laughs> the Galactus. <laughs> So that's an easy dub. I have no idea why. I hate. I hate. I sometimes hate when that happens, because turn six is like the longest turn, and maybe he was just hoping I would retreat or so. I don't know. What do we get here? Cloth. I always like Nightcrawler. Also, just because he's the easy one, we can always play him. No questions asked. Okay. We can get away with this. Vulture. You do realize that location changes, right, sir? Oh, options, options. I think, uh... Yeah, Vulture for sure. But, uh... Because we needed to make... Well, we know for a fact... Hmm. We can still build up Human Torch, though. That's good. So I can already see. Yeah, this is a solid hand here. What type of deck is this? This is a. It's got to be a Silver Surfer deck. Oh, actually, we're in. You drag nice. That helps me a little bit here. Ooh, interesting because. Is that the better play? Yeah, because we don't necessarily need to play cough so early. Also, if I had the sound on, he sometimes hits flame on when you drop him. You guys can see, like, the full fire with my fingers over it, so I can't really see the, the full fire. But, yeah, I think uh, for sure it is. He he got Magneto. That's that's lucky. Yeah. Let's see. Locations do switch, sir. Will you not see this? Well, he didn't. He didn't have human torch to this turn. We can protect this whole field if we wanted to. To be honest, yeah, we're definitely gonna hop off this Thor side. Uh, what sucks is, well, even if he follows us, that's bad on him. Mm -hmm. Okay, thoughts here. Where do we really want this cloth that? Yeah, because then we can move him. We can potentially move them twice. The thing is... They won't move twice. Someone won't move. Who don't we want to move again? I think we def so that so it's a lot on who goes first next turn in terms of and I think you go here for sure. Oh, okay. Well whoa whoa whoa. That's fine. That's pretty fine, so 
if we can get uh one saving, I can say we do have one saving grace, and that would have been uh Doctor Strange coming out. Hmm. This looks like a um leader deck because if he just copies the I feel like this is a leader deck but can I counter that? Wait, let me backtrack here. I think Torch here, because if he gets to eight, is he? If he gets to eight here, does that matter? No, we tie there, and then he loses with Lizard. Four. Here. Yep, I knew Leader would come out, so. We went there. Probably one of the rare times I've been able to counter Leader. <laughs> leader there. Because. Yeah. Let me think there. Yeah, and then he loses three there. Yeah, he. he uh, that was a. What was. Yeah. So. <laughs> I am kind of joyed right now because I I could man do you do you guys are just getting obvious with these leech leader plays man because the purpose of the leech if you don't know is that okay now now all you have to do and he even got a magneto and I got who did I get instead of magneto like come on now come on now get your Get your game up, man. But no, that was that was way too obvious of a leader play. I don't like. I hate. I I have. It's it is tremendous when you lose to that man. Um. Thoughts, guys. I think we make a craven play. We always want to pick Craven Middle though with the thing. So yeah. for now, for now, for now. Just until we see. Okay, good sunspot. I was hoping to see. That forces us to pit armor down earlier. Well, not really. It's a move deck. We don't have to follow the rules. We have all our move cards. For what purpose do we need y'all, right? All at this moment. None. None of you guys serve a purpose right now. So, I mean, Iron Fist would be nice here. Really, almost anybody would be nice here. The wave, good. I mean, we couldn't do anything next to him. Yeah, okay, there he is. I was going to say, you know who would be wonderful? Would be Doctor Strange, but at the same, in the same breath, we are not moving any cars who want to move on Doctor Strange. Okay, let's save armor for a second. I 
Oh, I was like, how was he able to play him so early because of that? Um, okay. What's interesting here is I almost want Cloth to die here because Cloth dying here is okay. You know who we, we really need your boy. Okay, yeah, because we weren't. We, oh, that's funny. We really need your homie and your boy Heimdall. Or we win nothing next turn. He can move cars too, though. It's always the negative about. Uh, always. The, of course, Forge, we have no. I mean, I guess that's the one play we can make. What does that make him? What are you? What are you at? No, because Doom is the highest. What are you? Doom's five. Oh, we also get five too. Then so. Unless Sun, what's Sunspot at four? If he doesn't play a six here, Sunspot takes that. I mean, I think we have no other options here anyway. So, I have to roll with it. Boy, Heimdall would have been nice here, but at the same time, yeah, because then we could even pick the order of draw. We could have had. Human Torch and um, yeah, we could have man Heimdall would have been perfect here because we we would have we would have even with no cloth to block that way, we could have picked Torch Vulture then Heimdall then we know for sure Torch and Vulture would have got moved there. So what is he thinking here? I think he thinks he he has to assume that the Heimdall comes out here. So so we tie. Magneto. So I get, does that take a, consider a double move, or no? Don't you often say you should tie with what's his name, right? Did we win all locations <laughs> after everything's all said? <laughs> we win all locations. <laughs> That's kind of funny. <laughs> Boy, this move deck. The move deck doesn't seem so strong, man. Been two stuff starts moving. Oh, and he did double twice. Vulture did double twice there. I mean, he got plus five. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, and then plus three. Yeah, because he got... Yeah, yeah, he would have been at 13. So, him moving middle, then moving right back. Yeah, he, he, he actually ain't unintentionally boosted up the Vulture crazy. I thought for a second when he got dragged back that he didn't get the boost, but yeah. Interesting. That's very interesting. So. It all worked out there. And luckily he went first too, so. It worked out. But that, what's funny is that location was already full. So I don't know what his, what would have been smarter there is if he had, um. There's a lot of things that would have been smarter if he had did there. I'm trying to think here. We really see now now we can't make see this is the this is the okay there it is. I was gonna say this is that point in time where we really can't make any real moves until we see a move card. So I think I think Doctor See, okay. I think do we want See once he goes down, we can't make the Doctor Strange play. Oh, you don't need, yeah, don't even worry about trying to, like, fill up Mojo, because we're going to, our cards are so low cost, that so we're going to, we usually always fill up Mojo, bro. Uh, first card can't be played here, so. That sucks. That sucks indeed, but what's funny is that we can make this play, right? What type of, let me, I need one more card to see what type of deck this is. It's looking like a Sinestro. This is probably, uh, what's that deck that uses, that, is it, what's the deck that uses Cerebro, that uses, yeah, Cerebro? Because isn't Cerebro like, like uh, people use Cerebro decks and they, they have, like, every card on the field is, like, two, is only worth two energy, so. Cerebro, then I even use, like, a Mystique and it's all type of. This might, it's in what my assumption this deck is, but I could be wrong. That was just a Patriot deck. So he only, he gets boosted the clone. 
Oh, well, force does nothing here, so that's fine. Mm, we fill up this location, though. Is that what we want so early on? I mean, I don't see any better place, so. But we do fill up this location early. Anyone else that can come out? No, we just. We only See, our only other move card is Dr. Is uh, Iron Fist, so. I guess we can make an Iron Fist Vulture play if, if the cards. <coughs> if the cards will us. It's like boost up, yeah. Torch, we need you at eight on this side, yeah. Yep, yep. It's an eight right there, and that's usually like not bad off two moves. And eight, a one eight off two moves isn't too hard to do. There's a second. Okay, so you just you just kind of lose that middle, that right left spot. I wouldn't even if I was him play any more cards there, but that's just me. And then we can always pull this. Uh, we got first card can't play. Hmm. Yeah, simply because he can't. We need to yeah focus on this side because he can't. He can't access it as good. I think as us. Or I mean, he has low cost cards. So I'm I'm tripping. He may be just as easily accessing. Yeah, Brood goes there. It's, it's fine. You do realize... Oh, it's after turn four. Never mind. Yeah. So. Guys, darn it. I think... Do we lose here? He needs two cards to go down. I'll tell you that. <laughs> We're in quite a pickle, too, because... Of the fact that Iron Fist just knocks him over. <laughs> we got to retreat. Reason why is because Ultron's in the back. I played enough of these ticks to know oh, that Ultron comes out. And that's, a, that's another plus four. We couldn't do, well, what could we have done there? A Heimdall would have saved our lives, I want to say. Heimdall middle would have saved us heavily. I don't think he can counter that because Ultron, what's Ultron? Is Ultron a six? Is it? Let me see. He he was going to make an Ultron play. Or if, if not, then I screwed myself. But I think I'm just, it's better safe keeps than not. Do we not have Ultron? Ultron is an eight, so, so yeah, I think we had a we messed up. The reason we messed up, we feared the symbiote play. The symbiote play might have not been that bad of a, a move because of <laughs> Lord have mercy on him. What is so funny about this is that, gosh, I was just trying to talk so highly at this location. I would have sacrificed Nightcrawler easily there. Golly, so what's the, man. Oh, thank Well, you could have told me earlier you was going to make that play. Let's see. Minus one. What sucks about... Mm, hmm. He just loses one, though. We don't, I really don't want to copy a one. Is this a better play?
I know with Heimdall, we already get 10 in the middle. And there's the Iron Fist that we didn't need. Oof, if we can pull Vulture, but we don't need to necessarily. There's no point. We can always play, like, on turn five, we can always play Iron Fist with anybody, so. Mm -hmm. What a strong play that was. Good. Oh my God, that's that's fine. That means these cards stay here, <sighs> and we don't even need like the twit. Like, I mean, you just are you gonna be able to counter Heimdall? If... No. You got well, 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 well. This is Maximus. Who comes out here? Oh, Red Skull. Oh. Uh... Yeah, I was gonna say with his ability, we could have. What's, what's your ability again? You know who was who had the lead there. You know, interestingly enough, plus two, so that would have been yeah, we'd have been tying. We'd have been tying there, and we would have still lost because they had twenty one minutes. This is looked like a, if I had to say. Oh, because risk calls a five turn. Yeah, if I had to say, this is definitely a um, a destroy. Deck. He had destroyer somewhere in the back. I don't know why I didn't pick that up on off of. Yeah, what am I tripping? I'm tripping. I said he has he can't do anything here. I was definitely tripping because if he had a um. Even if he had a destroyer, I think he would have been at fourteen too. So he, either way, we were screwed there. I think if we only could have just gotten off that Heimdall. It really, I don't think it was. Even if even if he didn't. Like Professor X, that middle, we still like lost pretty badly there. Let me wait. There might be a like a void, or it might be one of them spots that destroy or whatever. Let me just wait on it. Okay. So. Looks like Heimdall is not the play here. I really almost need even one more just to see what's... Hmm. We need one more because if we can just play off this middle, we're good. I need to really just see what the locations are, and that that mean that matters not at all. That um, We need a few more pieces here. Okay, there's the forge.
I did not want to see Heimdall. So early. What can we do here? Wait, I don't want to mess up. Wait, what happens first? Because I don't want to mess up, like, armor getting moved over here. Never mind, I'll just make this play. Why do you play leader so early? It makes no sense. Yeah, okay, okay. Fair enough. I think he wanted to. What was what? I don't understand. Am I? Was it a, okay? And, oh, another reason this is a slow Cooper game is because I seem to like. I I never snap, so when I'm even for sure I'm gonna win, it always seems like it's like. Well, I don't know. So I don't know anything can happen with a move deck. But for the most part, like we cancel out like Magneto and stuff like this. So it's it's a lot. Mm. Is there any way to cancel? Oof. We took their Deadpool. Oh snap! I don't feel better. So two hours to charge it up. Okay. We did. Ugh, we had a solid deck too to destroy. That pool a decent amount too. We got all the right pools too. It's just.
Well, we really do need more destruction, though. Well, death comes out this turn. So. How many, how much destruction is that? Hmm. For each card destroyed? One, two. I don't think we have enough for him. Duh. Oh shit. I didn't uh, I didn't factor in the fact Heimdall, he should play Heimdall far left. But uh that's interesting. We should have I didn't do the math there, but I should have calculated how much to get I think all we need if we play Venom turn if we had played Venom turn to see that those those reveals stopped us double unreveals, we could have we could have killed Deadpool twenty times and we could have Yeah, that was that was a solid deck too, by the way, for Venom. Uh I reset pretty nicely here to make a decent play. Uh it's pretty nice. We can at least we need a fudge who I would say it and that was actually the worst one I was supposed to say really anybody I was literally anybody else would have been perfect there but he hits of course the one man we needed so This deck is really this deck is really hurt a lot by uh by a scorpion. Okay, so there's the man we wanted to see. So actually now seeing that, no, we can't we can't undo anything really. No, yes, yeah, because we move he's gonna get moved anyway with uh Doctor Strange. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, anybody else really would have worked better on that. Getting hit by that uh Hulkbuster. Oh, he's a, he has Odin then. I wish I had a... He has Odin coming out here. This almost looks like one of my decks. I have a similar deck. Like I literally have a deck just like this. If we, if we wasn't for that plus one, we could have made a Vulture. We could also made a Vulture uh, comma here. Oh, so two of, the, two of y'all are going to move. That's not good. We need, oh, here's what I could do, actually, yeah. I was saying, we need, I need both, I really just need Torch the moves. Then. Here's another play we can make, though. What? He, that comes out super late. It always sucks when these cards start rolling in like late when you don't need them. Uh, you're like turn on the ring of my move deck is like your your first five cards determine your game almost. So.
Here's the thing. What options do we have here? Heimdall and keep Heimdall four plus. So we have a decent amount in that middle spot. I'm expecting. I'm expecting. Odin. There's no other. It's Odin. Got to be right. I'm not expecting Odin to. Odin's gonna be eight by himself though. So that's interesting. Gosh, this isn't looking great for us. Uh, white tiger. Oh, we okay. Then we win. Then mm -hmm. we just win here. That seven is not enough to save you, my boy. With the sixteen, we're gonna get from Human Torch. Even if you had two tigers there, you weren't gonna win. So. I was nervous about that one. I was thinking about doing um, Iron Fist uh, Vulture, maybe, but uh, mm -hmm. oh, this this video's gone on almost an hour, but we're in a uh, good shape, so nothing, nothing to fear. We can, it almost might be dumb to double up Forge, but Forge could really boost someone up here. So. Hmm. We could just... Let's see. Blizzard, that's a bad mistake because we're trying to fill up the board. So it's going to be a 2 3 or 2 1, actually. Oh, thanks. I kind of want to do double forge and just see who we can like throw on that. Oh, but here's more. Okay, good. Most of man's like somebody who benefits a little bit from it. We also could have played like another card down there. So. Oh, there's our infamous Vulture combo. I wonder, does he technically get played on... Uh, let's see what happens. Let's see where you technically get played at. Mystique? Oh, so what, what? Um, How many? What hit? With Luke Cage? Oh. I know what he's trying to play. If only we had Cosmo right now, it would be great. He's gonna play um, Hazmat, and that would have been like a minus. Like, yeah, that's just too much. If we had lower, if we if we was, see the thing about Hazmat isn't it isn't that bad unless you have a full unless you have a bunch of cards. That's when she's that's when Hazmat is a. Uh, 
at her worst. So yeah. But anyways, I don't know how many games we won. I don't know how many games we lost. Let me see. Wait, where we at? we still at fifty four, so we couldn't have lost too many because we was at fifty three or so ish. Um, move deck it might be the last uh, video we make for move deck, but man, it is fun. I like. I like the variants I have. See, when I saw this Iron Fist, the, I, I'm a big fan of the realistic, the realistic looking cards. So, for example, the very first one I ever got variant I bought with the coins gold I had was this Colossus because I thought, oh man, he looks realistic. That's what looks like a realistic uh, version, um, right? Still like cartoonish, but like in a more serious tone type deal. So that's why I really love these because they look realistic. I don't know, it's just anything that looks realistic is a uh, is 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 top tier to me. Um, also, who else had a who else, any else? What has a sweet variant on my other? Invis oh yeah, this one realistic. I think and crazy enough, we just like pull her from like a pack or something. So, but I really like that one. Um, but we had a variant of oh, also this Iron Heart realistic. Um, Innocent, so I really like those realistic looking ones. They were a one to me. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, man. Rudolph versus we're out. Peace, uh, and hit that like, subscribe, please.